I wanted to share with you an essential tool in becoming fat adapted when you're getting ready to go keto. You've all heard about the fat bomb and I make them all the time. I've been eating them for years, but I want to show you a very simple, very fresh, light fat bomb that's going to give you 10 grams of fat and just three carbohydrates. I want to share with you one of my favorite tools that allowed me to easily become fat adapted. It's the lemon fat bomb. It's delicious, it's super fresh, it's very easy to make. Once you've made your lemon fat bombs, you throw them right in the freezer and then you have them as a snack. You can even use them when you're traveling, when you're going to work, so you don't find yourself slipping out of ketosis. We're gonna start with these great ingredients. So I've got some melted coconut butter, cashew butter, coconut oil, a little bit of monk fruit. This is some lemon oil. I've got some coconut flakes right here and some lemon zest. What we're gonna do with these fabulous keto ingredients is we're gonna blend them up and then we're gonna put them into this little cupcake tin and pop them in the freezer. We're gonna start by zesting the lemons. I love all of the polyphenols that we get from these lemons and they smell so incredibly delicious. You need to make sure that you're using organic lemons. Next step is I'm gonna cut these beautiful lemons right in half. And then I'm gonna juice it. And then you can just juice it up. So, so fresh, so light. And also, you know, I always want you to be thinking about the electrolytes that you're getting from the foods, such as these lemons, very important. And you see the pith, the white part, this is what I'm always trying to get more of. I'll typically eat the pith. I like that as part of the nutrient profile that we're adding to whatever it might be. You know, there's so many nutrients in the white part in the pith, so I'm gonna zest some of the pith as well. I like the pith because this is where all of the autophagy activating properties are. Autophagy being, you know, our youth, our youth miracle that's inside of our body. So I like to feed my autophagy its favorite foods, its most beneficial foods. Okay, now we're gonna add in our coconut butter. I lightly soften this coconut butter add that in and this recipe is on my website so if you want all the details all of the tasty details you can find it right there and then I add cashew butter so the variety of different forms of fat are equally as important to you having the key benefits to a great 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 ketogenic lifestyle and then here is our Simply Good Fats coconut oil. You're getting all of the good saturated. You now know about the C8, the C10, and the C12, which is found in here. Caprylic, the C8 is the caprylic, the lauric acid, all of the immune boosting benefits. I'm gonna add in some monk fruit. Now, the reason that I'm making a sweet fat bomb versus a savory fat bomb is because this is an essential tool as you're becoming fat adapted. This is some lemon extract. We're gonna add a teaspoon of that as well. So you're gonna mix this until smooth. Each of these fat bombs are a specific tool to help you become fat adapted. So what I found when I first started to get into keto is that I really needed a fat bomb, one, two, three a day, to get my quantities of fat that I was eating up high enough. But now that I am totally fat adapted, I don't necessarily go for the fat bombs, but they're always there for me if I'm traveling, I don't have access to good fats as easily, and this is what they offer. So our very last step is just adding some beautiful coconut flakes. You can also add a little monk fruit if you need 
a little bit more sweetness. It just depends on where you are in your journey, in your ketogenic lifestyle journey, and how adapted you are to using fat as your source of fuel. Again, each of these has about 10 grams of fat. So if you're struggling to get enough good fat in your diet, this is gonna give you exactly what you need. And then we'll add just a little bit of the beautiful and nutritious lemon zest and pith that I have here. I'm gonna put these in the refrigerator for up to an hour and you can immediately start eating them then. I like to put these in the freezer once I've had one or two because they're so easy just to grab and go and they're refreshing, they're light, and you're getting all of those good fats. So here you have it. Thank you so much for watching this video on these beautiful little lemon fat bombs. You're getting a true treat here that will help satiate you, help allow you to become keto adapted and give you the good fats that your body will be using for fuel. Hey, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.